Hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to another video. Um, today is Wednesday. I'm kind of starting off halfway through the week. Um, it hasn't been a very eventful week. I was on call, 24 hour call on Sunday, and so I was post call Monday. And then Tuesday, yesterday, I just had um, sports medicine clinic in the morning and then my clinic in the afternoon. Um, neither of which was uh, super eventful, honestly. Um, and then yesterday when I got back from clinic, what did I do? Oh, I went to the gym, had a lazy workout because I really wasn't in the mood, but I still made myself go. Um, was there for like 40, 45 minutes and then I came home, ate and went to sleep. So today's Wednesday. And um, I worked with physical therapy this morning. I went to a different physical therapist's office. We did just my second physical therapy session this month as part of my sports medicine rotation. It was actually, um, I actually really like the incorporation of physical therapy because I learned so much that's helpful for, I mean, not only me, um, but also for my patients, especially my older patients and people with knee pain or like back pain, stuff like that. I also learned today, fun fact, that my left leg, no, yeah, my left leg is longer than my right leg. So I have a leg length of discrepancy that was diagnosed by the physical therapist today. He showed to me, I was like, oh, it's not bothering me right now, but it might later. So I'll keep that in mind. Um, and he said, if it starts bothering me, then I can get some like heel inserts on the right. I was like, wow, that's interesting. So that's where I am. Um, this afternoon we had Wellness Wednesday every fourth month, so every quarter, once a quarter, four times a year. In the afternoon, instead of didactics, we have the afternoon off protected time for Wellness Wednesday where we do wellness activities. So I'm part of the wellness committee along with some of my other co-residents and some faculty and we put together Wellness Wednesday. We went to a park. This was our first um, together event, what was I trying to say? It's our first in-person event as a residency program. We've been doing all this virtual stuff, um, but most of us, if not all of us are vaccinated and we were outdoors at a park, still wore masks, but we did all kinds of fun activities and I will put some videos in to show you. And then afterwards, a few of us stayed behind at the park to play basketball, which I haven't done in a minute. So I took a long shower, get all the pollen off, and here I am and it's Wednesday evening. You're all caught up. I'm going home this weekend for my brother's birthday, so I might start packing and then I just do some busy work on my computer, but honestly, not that much excitement going on um, over here these days. Um, so yeah, I will check in later and fill you in on how the rest of the week goes. Hello, hello. It is now Friday. Um, I just got done with sports medicine clinic for the morning. Saw some pretty cool cases, diagnosed some radiculopathy on my own, kind of based on things I've been picking up from spine doctors and um, like just how to do like a nerve root specific low back exam. And then I saw like lateral epicondylitis, knees, shoulders, um, some more typical MSK stuff. It's been good. I've been learning a lot, like a ton that I would like actually use re regularly in my future practice. So I've definitely been enjoying my rotation. Resident practice meeting is a thing that we do uh, for the residents in my clinic. And we have monthly meetings just to talk about what's new, what's going on in the clinic, what concerns do we have, what help do we need, um, what um, what can help us improve our workflow? What improvements do we want to make? X, Y, Z. It's a time for us to learn about any new policies, any new procedures, like, oh, okay, so now the process for mammograms is this or that. Because the attendings do their own practice meeting, and then we have ours. And we have a designated person called a clinic champion who uh, participates in the attending meetings and then tells us whatever like we need to know so we don't all like have to do that with our busy schedules. So um, I think it's a pretty cool thing that we do um, and kind of gives us a voice in our clinic. So I appreciate that. 
been, it's been a pretty boring week, I'm not gonna lie. After yesterday when I got back from clinic, I just was on the phone for a few hours, catching up with friends. Um, I try my best to stay in touch with people, but it's hard. Uh, but I you know, was able to spend some time on the phone, catching up with people and talk to uh, family and whatnot. So this afternoon I have a reading half day. Am I reading? No, but you know, to each his own. It's a reading half day uh, and I am going home this weekend like I mentioned earlier. I am, I have my suitcase packed but I have an appointment, um, a dermatologist appointment. I've been seeing, trying to like get help um, with my face and like clearing up like this hyperpigmentation and stuff. So I have an appointment with him. I have a black male dermatologist. How about that? If you need a black male dermatologist in the Charlotte area, hit me up. I will tell you his name. Um, he's great. And uh, so I'm seeing him and then I'm gonna go straight to the airport from there. Hey y'all, excuse the video quality. I am at home being a lazy bum. Literally, I, I have barely moved a muscle. I mean, just been lying in bed, eating, chilling, talking on the phone. Went out to eat for my brother's birthday, which was fun. But other than that, your girl has been off of her feet. I helped my dad get on to a Zoom meeting, which was a struggle. I ended up just giving him my laptop and logging in from there. But otherwise, my mom is making ukwa, which is... Um, it's a Nigerian dish with, um, I guess the English word is breadfruit. I don't know how else to explain it, but um, it's still cooking. It takes hours to cook, so we're working on that. But for now, I'm chilling, watching YouTube videos, doing little tasks for my parents, and um, relaxing, which is what I do when I come home. Don't answer to anybody. I just stay my behind in bed <laughs> eat food and um you know do whatever i can to help out so that's what i'm doing that's what i'm on we're going to church tomorrow and then uh, my flight leaves tomorrow night <laughs> Charlotte. It's like 10 o'clock. I just came home, took a shower. I usually like to unpack ASAP when I get back from any type of trip, but it's already 10 o'clock. I have clinic tomorrow. I need to look over my patients. I'm tired. My stomach kind of hurts. I don't know what's going on. I just need to get in bed. So I don't really have that much in there because it was only a weekend. I will unpack tomorrow after clinic and that is going to be a wrap on this week's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Very uneventful, but you know, sometimes that's just how it is. So I will catch you guys in my next video. I hope that um, you guys subscribe and comment and like my videos. And I will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.